What if you had these where they were oval? Yeah, um, the oval and the round is, is um, if, if you had this run capacitor and you knew it failed and you went to the local shop to get it replaced and they gave you an oval 55 microfarad, that'd be fine. Okay. The shape does not matter, it's the rating. And the purpose of preheating the compressor is what? Uh, it's to make the, um, it's to keep the oil, um, some John Deere tractors, even cars you can get like oil preheaters. The oil yeah. is, is uh, it's not as thick when it's warm. So if you have cold start situations, the crankcase heater will, um, it'll get the oil um, more liquid before it. Um, so like a diesel engine. I think, I think it also, and I'll have to check on this, but I think um, it also, by warming it, um, the refrigerant will migrate, and when the, um, for, for wherever the refrigerant happens to be sitting in the system at the time, it will migrate to a warmer location, and that way, um, when, when the uh, refrigerant migrates to that position, which is here, where the current is here, be, it's going to bring more lubricant with it. The oil kind of mixes with it and travels throughout the system the entire time. So by bringing the refrigerant, you also bring the lubricant back for cold starts. The scrolls don't have that problem because um, the, um, the spiral is up the top, not down at the base. So I guess for whatever reason, the lubricant is already where it needs to be. So it's, it's not required. Which there really isn't that much on the line side of that contact. Up here? Right. Um, no, I mean, you're looking at on a piston, you've got the crankcase heater and you've got the transformer. And that's it. So, before turning the breaker on, right. now this is turned on, it's tripping the breaker. It's got to be. It's important for your hand to go here, too, because if these, um, if this um, lug gets burned off, um, okay. or if these points in here, if these two points weld together okay. and it stays down, even though that it's trying to release, okay. then you'll have like, it could go to a ground. Right. So, I... I The other thing to notice is that these two are yellow. Some of our older transformers, if you go to a service on an older unit, I think they were blue and green were the two colors. Mm -hmm. Or yellow and blue, yellow and blue. Depends on how old the units are. We've switched to those maybe four or five years ago, maybe. Yeah, we've been selling them for quite a few years. Yeah. You'll know which ones um, is the 24 volt loop because you'll know which one goes here. The other side um, goes to the top. If you ever replace a transformer and you're not using one of ours, just read the label. It'll tell you which one's the high voltage side and which one's the secondary. Just make sure the secondary goes to the 24 volt loop and make sure you're. Like if you have one like this, you have to read the side and it'll say um, common black. And then red's 208 volt, blue is 240. So you're using the common black and the 240 volt blue. Other other transformer brands, um, if you're buying from somewhere else, are going to have their own color scheme. So in order to check the transformer right away, just put one lead on one side and pull the wire down into the thermostat. Yeah, and that, it, if you're suspecting it's the transformer itself not providing 24 volts, then confirm this is 240 and then check if that's 24. If that's not 24, transformer should have one. How old do they go back? 
Nothing, nothing in that back panel is the most, you know, I change that all the time. There are, I mean, there are ones that I've changed more often than the others, but there has never really been a, I mean, they ask me that all the time, what do I want to first? Well, it depends. I mean, around here, I'll even start to think of what's wrong with that as I'm walking in the unit, because if the unit's installed, like if your pool's out here in your yard and you have your pump and your filter and your heater over here by the woods, roads, you know, I'm thinking roads before I even get there if it's an electrical issue, like if they say it won't start. But if it's all up by the pool and, you know, there's like acres of grass around and it's, you know, it's less likely to be that, so. It's just a, it's just a puzzle. You, you're approaching a puzzle and knowing the rules to the game is just, a, is, is, it's not hard, it's just, you know, is it this, this, and this, and if it is, then look here. If it's, if it's these things, then look there. See, I saw it. If you contact her, <coughs> the contact people will be shutting her, you got to replace her. Just replace it, yeah. Just this one and um, else? You will want to... You want to replace that too. Well, you'll want to you'll wanna look and see if other components cause the chattering. If a transformer, which should be putting out 24 volts, mm -hmm. is going bad and it's only putting out 19 volts, mm -hmm. that's enough to engage this. That's enough to pull this down. Uh -huh. But but it's just barely, and you'll get, yeah, you'll get that. And, yeah. and it'll sound like... It's, right. It'll sound like a loud buzzing noise. Yeah. And that, that's those contacts. And every time it pulls away, it's back together, it'll right. start to form carbide. I had some last year where one of that one down in Hagerstown uh, had the two heat pumps on it. Where one, the contact was shut. And when I called up here and I so told you to do it, she hadn't said this, but I think she said it time to leave also. Yeah. Um, she recommended everybody to both the same time. She'll know if there's a trend in a certain, you know, if, she, if you tell her this is what you know, she'll say. It. There's yeah. a bad batch of transformers, right. or and there's probably worse than that. Right, so she'll right. say, I don't know if your unit fits, you know, is in that age yeah. range, but it's close. Yeah. You know, it's, um, you know, ten dollar item or something. It's right. your, it, it's worth your time just to replace yeah. it right there. So that's what I was saying. 